All right, guys, this is Slippery P. Mozon. We're at Mucho Burrito in Canada. We're basically going to be, uh, I just got the hotter than hell. You can see here, Mucho Burrito. I got two lines of the friggin' hot sauce, as you can see here. The Mucho Burrito, the fine people here. We ended up going to be trying this guy out. There's my buddy Austin there, going to be trying this out. So I'm going to open this guy. I tried it as you can see on our last last video I did with Denmark Bros. But I'm gonna try it out by myself just to see really how hot it is. So give me a second while I place this properly in a tin foil so I don't make a mess. And give me a sec guys. Alright guys, I just placed it. I'm gonna take a bite out of this thing. They didn't use the same uh, red tortilla shell they used last year. The gentleman told me it's because it's uh, it doesn't hold as good as the uh, as a normal tortilla shell. So we're gonna take a bite to see exactly uh, how hot this bad boy is. I'll rate it out of ten. So let's see. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Say the truth, guys. It's hot. I just got I got the hiccups, hiccups already. <coughs> Whoa, Jesus. You get hiccups when it's spicy? Uh, yep. Oh, yeah. As you can see, guys. Oh. It is hot. Uh, uh. Whoa. <laughs> it is spicy. <laughs> Jesus. That's some Dr. Pepper. Maybe it's the worst thing. But now, Austin. He doesn't find it hot. What do you find? How do you read it as hotness? Well, I got the wimpy, so I'd say like a three or four. Yeah? Maybe. Yeah. And the taste? The taste's really good. Yeah? The bacon's really good, and so is the sauce or the marmalade. Yeah? It's good. Um, well, that's awesome. Yeah, Austin didn't decide to go with the hot as hell, but I did. And I, it's hot. I wouldn't say it's a ice cream hot, but uh, give me the hiccups. And for hotness, I would rate it a out of ten. I would rate it as a six. You know, it gave me the hiccups, but not enough that I'm reaching for milk or pacing like we normally do. So yeah, I would rate this a, a six out of hotness. Taste, obviously, guys, it's mucho burrito. Can't beat it. It's good food. I just got a normal regular size, so there you go. <laughs> hey, there you go, guys. I rated a six for hotness. And for taste, obviously, you love it. It's a 10 for taste. There you have it. Mucho burrito. Should we beat Lozo? And Austin, they decided to do a nice little cameo. All right, guys. Peace out. Hey, okay, guys. <clears throat> I ended up forgetting saying I got the chicken. Got chunks of bacon pretty much fully loaded. But, man, I lied. This is... It's hot. This is the aftermath. As you can see... <clears throat> Austin's, Austin's laughing at me. Even this, the wimpy was hot too. Yeah, you found wimpy, the wimpy was hot. Wimpy got hotter as I finished it. Yeah. Right now, oh my god, my nose is running. <laughs> oh shit, my lips, my lips are on fire. Again, it's not ice cream, you know. <laughs> it's hot. <clears throat> my lips are on fire. It's hot as heck, man. And like I said, not going out, reaching out for ice cream, but it's hot. It's it's almost on the borderline of unbearable, but I want to show you. We're about a little bit more than half. Two-thirds done. As you can see, this is what's all in it. Chunks of bacon, rice, beans. I ended up getting a good chunk. I got I added two lines of that hot sauce. The habanero sauce, or ghost pepper sauce. So, yeah, so I lied, guys. I'd say now I bumped it up from six to... Seven. I would say six to seven for sure. <laughs> not that it's unbearable, but <clears throat> pretty damn close. It's not, you know, a full uh, scorpion pepper hot or anything like that, but I'm bumping it up to seven, guys. Do a seven. All right, so there you go. That's the aftermath of the Nutri Burrito. And as you can see, guys, I'm here having a great old time. Not many people here, but it's good. All right, guys. Peace out.